everyone it's um may 22nd 2024 and i have words of the lord from today and i'm just going to say a quick prayer and get started lord jesus i thank you father god for this day for your words your guidance your direction help us to hear your words and bring them right back to you lord help us to pray for discernment understanding and revelation in the mighty name of jesus i pray over my brothers and my sisters i plead the blood of jesus over them their homes their jobs are coming and they're going lord let no weapon formed against them prosper in the mighty name of jesus i pray for their families and their children lord i give you glory honor and praise in the name of jesus i pray that this message goes out to everybody that needs to hear it in the name of jesus i pray amen okay my child speak to my children all my children who call themselves my children awakened and slumbered awaken now my children do you not see the signs all around you do you not have eyes to see lost in this world focused on the unnecessary instead of preparing your hearts and your homes i tell you many will be lost confused going to and fro trying to find enough and it's capitalized underlined exclamation point enough mine will not lack I am your provider. Would I feed a sparrow and not my own children? I am a good, good father. Miracle signs and wonders are upon you. And um, remember the Israelites, even though they were in the wilderness, they were fed every day. Their clothes did not wear out and they had water. I mean, they complained about it, but they had, they had, they had meat. They had manna and they had water um and even um i think it was um oh i can't remember his name that was fed by the um by this the bird that came and gave him food um elijah um so god will god will provide for his own all you need to know is to call on him call on him and i pray for my loved ones um i pray supernatural provisions that the lord will make a way where there is no way because with him there is nothing nothing's impossible i also pray um supernatural provisions supernatural um protection guidance and direction that's what he told me to pray for them everything supernatural because he is the god of impossible supernatural is what we should be thinking because that's that's him um he makes something out of nothing it we we could think it for him for them or we could pray it for them but um whatever we pray believe it think whatever he said whatever you um one day he was telling me whatever you can think because i think so small whatever you can think think bigger and he can make it happen if it's his will he will make it happen he is the god of impossible we have to remember that um so his will not lack if we're his and 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 we're seeking him knowing that having faith faith is everything it really is you have to have faith and know that the lord is your provider he's going to take care of you no matter what the world looks like we're not to fear for anything no matter what we've been told is going to happen around us, um, it, it, nothing matters but him protecting us. We are under the shadow of his wings. And and pray that. Pray that for yourself and your, your children, your homes, your families. Mine will not lack. I am your provider. Would I feed a sparrow and not my own children? I am a good, good father. Miracle signs and wonders are upon you. Mine will not only have enough for themselves but also those around them discern who i send to you not all are who they say not all have a pure heart pray now for all who i bring to you that they accept your words that those seeds will grow on good soil pray for your harvest daily pray for their hearts minds supernatural peace that surpasses all understanding mine will go to and fro pray for your words to pierce their hearts up until now many have not truly put down this world and strived for mine but many will 
you my faithfuls are my example they will want what you they will they will want the freedom you have the peace of mind in the chaos they will want me tell them i'm your god almighty the one who came in the flesh walked this earth shed his blood so that they would be free of their sin and be renewed born again turning from their old man their sinful flesh tell them it is now time to walk in the spirit the flesh no more tell them my ways are grander higher than your understanding perfect the heart with i perfect the heart with trials and tribulations i refine a refiner's fire perfecting a diamond that is my way and all of mine have gone through the refiner's fire mine are strive are shining diamonds mine will shine bright my loves rejoice you were created for such a time as this my chosen generation time to step up and walk the walk my chosen my called time to answer the call much will come upon this world and as i say the harvest is plentiful and the harvesters few pick up those mantles pray for your call harvesting is upon you time to save the lost who do not know they are lost to awaken the slumbered and for the found to endure 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 mine will make it into the promised land pray 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 without ceasing come to the father again and again Come now, my faithful, come to my feet. Bring me your undivided attention. Your hearts, I am for you. Who can be against you? I am the God of impossible. If I say it, you believe it. Yeshua HaMashiach, the one true Messiah, Jesus the Christ of Nazareth, the Nazarene, lover of your souls, King of kings and Lord of lords, the beginning and the end of all things, big and small. Time is now in its capital N-O-W underlined. Come now, my faithful, my broken, my lowly at heart. My ways are higher. Come. And this message finished at 444. As soon as I looked up, it was 444. And that's the message for today. Pray for discernment, understanding, revelation. And come every day to the Lord. It's a daily walk. It's not a one day, one hour a week time with the Lord and really that's not even time with the Lord I mean you're going to church and you're you're praising and everything but time with the Lord is communing having one-on-one -on -one quiet time with him praying in, in your Bible um, praying and worshiping him um, getting in that secret place that's time with the Lord um, fasting so you can come closer to him um so keep on going know that jesus is the only way the only truth to everlasting life and he loves you so much there is nothing that he would not do for his own he his own will not lack he says so take everything to him your worries your stresses don't we're not to have any um fear about of what's to come or anything that's that we even that that our mortal eyes even see um because we walk in faith and not by fear he gives us the strength that we're we, that we need pray strength in the lord um and take everything pray pray supernatural peace of mind and heart that that's what i pray also so god bless you guys have a good night and pray without ceasing and keep on seeking the Lord every day. It's a, all day, every day. Pray throughout your day. Love you guys.